Hello everybody and welcome back to Brighouse Town TV. Um, we've got Bill here after a defeat to Stocksbridge Park Steels. Um, what are your thoughts on the game? Where did we go wrong, Bill? Uh, just didn't want it enough. Didn't want it enough. Uh, they were better from start to finish, all over the pitch, uh, from back to front, front to back. Uh, very disappointing, really. Uh, very disappointing. Um, yeah, wow. I don't put my finger on it. Can't really. Um, but it starts from sort of we lost the midfield battle that's for certain we, we definitely lost that battle and then I think everything else was infectious and, and, and you know the first goal uh, obviously a bit of confusion you know but still we've switched off we've not dealt with the, the, the first header we've not had any cover on behind it uh, and then it's obviously a tap in 1-0 uh, and then you know after that again there's not much between it but then the second goal it's a it's a free you know we've had a we've had a sort of warning before that where we've not attacked the ball on a free kick it's gone through fortunately to Mikey um and then uh, we've got another free kick out on that uh, uh, their left our right uh, and then he just swung it in and again we've not attacked the ball and it's it, you know kids got a flick on it and it's gone into the back of net 2-0 uh and then you know it, it was just systematic uh, not systematic it was um what word am I looking for? It was just sort of continuous in regards to defenders and, and midfielders uh, uh, just not dealing with that first ball and, and they've got in again uh, just before half time and Mike has pulled off a brilliant save to keep the score down to 2-0. Uh, we've got in at half time and, and, and to be honest, um, you know, it was a quiet dressing room in there. It was a quiet dressing room which was sort of a bit disappointing but you, you could see um, that the wind had been taken out of us, uh, and that the, the you know the, the lack of um, lack of desire uh, to, to fight for every uh, ball, fight for every blade of grass, all the minimums were, wasn't matched. It wasn't matched in regards to what they were doing, and, 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 and that's it. That's it really. Uh, and then the third goal is just comical. You know, centre forward comes off who, who kind of dominated our sort of defence for, for the majority of the game. Uh, did everything our two forwards didn't do uh, in terms of hold the ball up, get to the ball first, win headers. Um, my two didn't do that today, or my my, my four players didn't do that today. Uh, he's flicks it on, and then we've switched off at the back again. Uh, kids gone through, and it's, it's a good finish, three 0 And then after that, we're, we, you know, we're roughing and puffing, but the, the game's done. Um, and then we go down to ten men because of an injury, and, and to, to, to Alex, you know, he took a took a couple of knocks on the head, which. Got him a bit dizzy, and, and um, uh, we had to see. It was just a case okay, so of seeing the game out then, because we had ten men for the last 20, 25 minutes. So yeah, really disappointing, uh, especially after you know what what has been a good week uh, in regards to sort of training. Um, but you know that's that's what you get when you've got sort of a, a lot of experience in a new side. You get that inconsistency, and that's the frustrating thing because they've shown that they can do it. Uh, they've shown that they've got. The, the, the quality and the attitude at, at times to do it, but you know, with with inexperience at times and with, with sort of uh, um, you know areas where we lack in quality, um, you know that that was telling. And you know, you know, at the end of the day, they got to a playoff final last year at Stocksbridge, uh, and there's a reason for that. Um, you know, because you know because they they've got that consistency and desire they've got that experience they've got that consistency in performance when it comes to just desire you know as i said they played some good stuff at times but it's more around down to our lack of work rate uh, really uh, than anything else yeah so we had a couple of the new lads starting today uh, yeah. with the keeper and center half and sam bentley moving into into a more of a six role is that something yeah. that we're going to see more often or yeah, I mean, you know, we 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 made some changes. Um, you know, we obviously we brought George in, we brought Mikey in. Uh, I, I thought Mikey did brilliantly for what, what he had to do. Certainly, some pulled off some great saves. Um, you know, obviously George he's, he's not played as much football as he would have liked. Um, so it's a case of looking to get himself up to speed. Uh, and then with Sam again, I thought he was brilliant. It's one of them where Sam's got the ability technically uh, to, to to do that role. And I thought he did it really well. To be fair. Um, and it, it, it's one of them, but again, he's another one that's that's inexperienced, and you know where you want in someone in there to 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 really get hold of the midfield a little bit. He, he hasn't got that experience today uh, to, to to do that because obviously he's a youth player uh, 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 at Bradford City. So 
yeah, um, we'll see more of that because he's more than capable of doing it. But, you know, again, it's another one where we've conceded three goals. Yeah, so like like you say, Alex Phillipson going off with the injury. I thought he had quite a good second half. Um, has we got any updates on, on the injury there? Is... Um, yeah, I mean, Alex didn't set his standards today. Um, I, I, I'll say that. Um, he, 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 since he's come in, he's been brilliant, Alex has. Um, but I don't think he... He set his standards today. Certainly didn't keep his standards uh, for, for what he set. Uh, in terms of the injury, you know, we'll, we'll assess it. Obviously, he said he couldn't see, so it's going to be a concussion. He's going to, if he's come off with that, it's going, to, you know, it's going to be, I think, it's seven or fourteen days, whatever it is. So, you, you know, we'll, we'll, we'll follow the guidelines, and he'll be out for that amount of time, and, and, and that's it. Fortunately, we've got cover in there now with with Jack. Um, so, yeah, we'll we'll we'll, um, we'll, 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 we'll we'll use the cover that we've got. So we've got Cliff Rowe uh, next week in the FA Trophy. How are we looking to prepare for that that game? Yeah, it'll be it'll, you know it'll be, we'll get back to it. We'll get back to the drawing board and, and, and listen. It, today was about basics. We didn't do the basics well uh, at all in terms of work rate um, throughout the team. You know we weren't, we weren't nowhere near first balls. We weren't for nowhere near second balls, and then it, it was infectious throughout the side. And then after that, you know we were sloppy. So that all be, that's all mental. You know that that's nothing else. So. We'll get the mentality right this week uh, in regards to, to um, you know, uh, training. Uh, get ourselves off. You know, there's no point in dwelling on it. The only thing you can do now is, is it'll be a long week because of the fact that we haven't got no midweek game. I prefer to go straight into a next game to, to put it right. You know, uh, it'll be a long week and then we'll, we'll, we'll prepare for Saturday. Well, Saturday and Monday. Yeah, perfect. Well, thanks for your time, mate.